A playoff opener. A brutal uncalled foul. Caitlin Clark, one of the WNBA's biggest stars, left battered and bruised. But the story doesn't end there. Fans are outraged, and the fallout could change everything. Stay tuned to find out what happened. Caitlin Clark's appearance in the WNBA playoffs came as a catastrophic chain of events after she was brutally hit by decomposition of DJI. What was meant to be a highlight for the league turned into a scandal's moment as courtesy of Clark 4 and his fans the Black Eye Dagger. In this article, let's determine what transpired on the court. What were the fans' emotions about this event? And what does this mean for Clark and the WNBA? The opening game of the playoffs, Indiana Fever against Connecticut Sun, had an interesting turn of events. A sports play carried out by DeJanai Carrington saw Caitlin Clark get hit, a foul that was foregone by the referees. Clark sported a black eye, which infuriated both the fans and players, and even affected the performance of Clark. This game will be most well-remembered for the absence of a foul call, considering how heated it was, and how bad the foul determination was for the officials and players. Clark was affected after the injury despite her being an incredible player. The shooting guard went from being one of the best sharpshooters in the league to hitting only 23.5% of her shots. It is not a secret that the injury had an impact, and even the fever lost to the Sun 93-69. to And even though Clark dished out 8 assists, those would be the only highlights of the game for her because the entire team suffered a crushing defeat. This incident did not merely remain confined to the arena. Fellow fans, including celebrities like Barstool's Dave Portnoy, took to social media raged about the frustration. Social networks erupted in condemnation of the referee and the playing of WNBA games in general. Many of these fans believed the lately reported damaging injury to Mystic star players shed light on the broader WNBA referee and player protection aspects. In spite of the injury complaint and the crying of the crowd, Caitlin Clark acted quintessentially graceful. She did not, in her post-game comments, seek to blame Dejanai Carrington for the terrible shooting that she had endured. This scandal is not finished yet. As fans are furious and the WNBA is on the chopping block, the league should start dealing more seriously with the issues of officiating in the upcoming games. Regarding Clark, she is still concentrated on how she plays and what is to be done next by the team. The next course of action could well define the course of this playoff season and the narrative that follows it.